Hi, so here I am again to show you the third basic principle of rib cage placement, okay? So your rib cage is connected to your thoracic spine, okay? So if you, if I ask you to bring your arms in front of you and then lift the arms up, what I usually see in my clients initially is that as they raise the arm, the shoulder comes up to the ears and then they go like these with the rib cage. They open the rib cage. So what happens is you get an extension on your thoracic spine. And basically you want to have an extension on your lower, but you want to have a slight flexion on your thoracic. So if you engage your rib cage in the perfect alignment, then your spine will be on the perfect alignment too. Now, what you have to do too is bring your shoulder away from your ears, okay? So, I'm gonna show you these laying down because for you to do it is easier, okay? Initially, so from here, okay, remember, this is the third basic principle. So you have the first, breathing, the second, neutral and imprint, it's pelvic placement, and now you have the third one. So think about starting right away using them all together. So first, neutral, okay? And then if I tell you, bring your arms up there, 90 degrees angle, and then you start bringing the arms back, be careful that you don't do that zoom, okay? Do you see my back? See this? My rib cage is completely open and my shoulder is really here up next to my ear. And what I wanna do to fix this is right this. Close the rib cage. And I'm gonna show you a funny thing, okay? So the way that you know that your rib cage is closed because it's an instinct thing, you do like this. You wanna laugh? Laugh with me because that's the way to go. From here, you go, ha ha ha, okay? When you do that, so I laugh a lot with my clients because I always tell it, give me a laugh. Just laugh with me. And then they go, ha ha, I say, ha. See, that's, you are engaging your abdominal wall. So obviously you are closing your rib cage, okay? And with that, you are placing your spine completely in neutral because if you have your thoracic spine in neutral, in a slight flexion, then all the rest of the curvatures are going to be right in neutral, okay? So here we go. Let's do the exercise with me two or three times, okay? So. Remember the neutral position. Give a little laugh. Ha ha ha. Close your rib cage. Okay. Arms up. And then here we go. Inhale as you lower your arms. Close your rib cage because when you inhale, it's hard. Okay. Remember, breathe to the sides and the back. And then exhale and bring it back up. Okay. Inhale. Close your rib cage. Breathe to the sides and back and get your shoulders away from your ears and bring him back up again here we go one more time inhale close your rib cage and go 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 shoulders away from your ears exhale and bring him back your arms down and that's it i hope this is helpful and always remember if you want to check your rib cage okay bring your arms up and just give a little laugh <laughs> Okay, just be careful with one thing. When you do that, haha, be careful with uh, your spine that you don't flex it, okay? Because when we laugh, we can do that, ha, ha, ha. okay? So don't take your spine out of neutral, just ha, close your ribcage, all right? And that's it for today, and I'll come back with the next principle. Bye-bye for now.